looks like a beautiful day outside. Perfect weather for implementing an evil scheme. Let's see what we can come up with, shall we? It's a symbol of the oppression of the working class. Also, it's a wrench. Robot SpongeBob, move! I order you! He isn't answering my commands. He must be broken. Luckily, as his creator, I know his innermost workings. Fixing him should be a snap. A wrench can be quite a precision tool, as long as you know exactly where to throw it. Think that mop looks too big for me to carry? Shows what you know. Down here! What do you want? I need to find a way to steal Mr. Krabs' secret Krabby Patty recipe. I've tried everything I can think of. In other words, not much. You aren't helping. Have you checked all the evil plans in your filing cabinet? Yes, every last one from A to Y. There is nothing left. Um, what about Z? 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 The letter after Y? Groups? Oh, boy. I'm spiritually bankrupt. I have no soul. How can I find my place in this cruel, cruel world? You're complaining to me about having no soul? I'm a computer. Have a little tact. Oh, uh, sorry, <laughs> my dear. That is all for now, wife. Return to your spousal duties at once. By spousal duties, do you mean overlooking your many faults and watching you blunder your way through another doomed attempt to take over the world? I have one word for you. Magnet. You couldn't lift it. Plan C, yeah. steel crown, frame crabs, I like it, I like it, it's got panache. So let's do this step by step. Step one, get to Neptune's castle and steal his crown. Child's play. the robotic SpongeBob and see if he performs his duty. Jetpack! It's my jetpack! It allows me to fly far above the heads of those who will one day be my vassals! Whoa! This jetpack doesn't handle too well. I must not have tightened the phalange sufficiently! Let's hope I don't get into an accident!
Ah, Neptune's castle. Why don't I have a castle, you may very well ask. Sadly, that question lacks a satisfactory answer. Anyway, let's get down to business. It's a stinky seahorseshoe. Seahorses don't even have feet. What genius thought of these? You wouldn't need a battering ram to break these down. A battering worm would do just fine. It might be a threat to some, but to me it is a coil of the strongest rope! Hello, clown! What? Who's there? Down here! Yikes! Sea lice! Please don't bite me! I am not a louse, and I would never bite you. I don't know where you've been. I knew we needed to get the castle tinted. Listen, Toady, I need information. What do you want from me? You're a jester, right? Do something funny. Er, uh, how about this? Wow, limber. I'm trying to get into the throne room. I have important business with King Neptune. Now, how would I do that? You probably want to bite him. I assure you, I do not. The doors to the throne room are electric. There's a button on the side that slides them open. I call it the electric slide button. I can't reach it. Guess you're going to have to bite someone else then. Can you help me open the doors? I'm not opening the doors for a louse. For the last time, I am not a louse. Well, I'm not opening the doors for you anyway. There's a nail sticking out of the wood next to the button and my hat always gets caught on it. I'm not risking my 3070 cotton blend for anybody, especially a louse. A nail, huh? Hmm, I've got to go. You can say that again. The door is way too big for me to move. If only my intellect could be made flesh, I would be unstoppable. It looks like a button. Unfortunately, I can't reach it. I'm not going to jump up and down trying just to amuse you. I'll have to find another way. Aha! It's a stinky seahorse shoe with a thread tied to it. Genius, I tell you! Mind over matter once again. Each victory is sweeter than the last. The door is way too big for me to move. If only my intellect could be made flesh, I would be unstoppable. Aha! Once again, my genius silences the pundits! Ah! 
Aha! The crown is mine! Mr. Krabs, prepare to meet thy doom! <laughs>